Whoa, Patty, you ever been in a hot air balloon before? <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> well, look down there. You can see our house. I think it's way over there. There's some dogs and cats over there. And some birds flying around. Oh, hey, down there. Melanie and Rudy, you wouldn't believe what we can see up here this high. There's high opportunities all around and for everyone. This city and this county is growing faster than ever. I see a more robust network of childcare providers throughout the city, thanks to 4.3 million in enhanced reimbursement funds distributed by Workforce Solutions. And Hattie, I also see the results of over $3 million in local funding, granted by the city and by Travis County invested in rapid training for laid off workers during the pandemic. And in our schools, Hattie, I see more than 23,000 students from five regional school districts supported with career programs and post-secondary education options. And Hattie, this view reminds me of why Travis County continues to support Workforce Solutions and their work to empower people in this new economy. But you know what, Hattie, over there, I also see some challenges on the horizon. Can you see those? See the Locally, we still have 876,900 unemployed persons in all of Texas. So that's basically one-tenth of the total unemployment or unemployed people in the U.S. And here in the Austin MSA, we're looking pretty good with 4.2% unemployment rate. But across Texas, we've still got 6.2% unemployed. So we lag behind the total U.S. unemployment rate of 5.4%. And Hattie, that puts us behind a few states, Georgia, North Carolina, Michigan, Florida, and even Ohio. Many unemployed workers across Texas are look, looking to Austin as a soaring example, not just as a jobs creator, but also as a model of how a community can come together to upskill workers, assist employers, and support working families. I look over this amazing view of the city and the county, and I see major corporations and employers such as Tesla, you went there one time to see all the cranes, Apple, Samsung, and others bringing billions of dollars of new investment to our city. Even Del Valley ISD is one of those employers. We know there is work to ensure that new jobs are created for residents to have career opportunities, including those who are currently unemployed. We must create new strategies to raise hope and expectations for everyone here in Austin and in Travis County and in the surrounding areas. And that's why the new phase of the Community Workforce Plan and the ideas and strategies that come out of it are so critical to our community. Balloon's getting a little unsteady, Hattie. You hanging on okay? <laughs> now you're gonna have to excuse me because I see some commotion down below. Hey, what are you up to down there? Hey, whoa up there, space cowboy. You need to come on back down here to Earth so we can roll up our sleeves. We've got some work to do together. Our Texas unemployment rate dropped again in July to 6.2%, and we've added 714,800 non-farm jobs since last year. Texas has added 80,900 jobs in July. And as far as I can see, even down here on the ground, all of that's good news for Texas workers because it strengthens our economy and creates opportunities for rewarding careers. In the Austin area, we have more than 1.1 million employed people, and we've added 77,200 jobs just this year alone. Workforce Solutions Capital Area is helping prepare job seekers for these new jobs. All those programs are working for all Texans. In just the past year, Workforce Solutions Capital Area has served 13,208 adults through their programs. And that included 684 persons with a disability, 1,273 ex-offenders looking for a restart, 635 veterans transitioning to the civilian workforce, 63 foster youth at a critical stage in their beginning adulthood, 493 persons experiencing homelessness, and 9,181 persons claiming unemployment benefits before participating in jobs training. 78% of participants found employment in their field of training after engaging with Workforce Solutions. So no matter your viewpoint, whether you're at 30,000 feet or right here on terra firma, the key is work together. The good news is, is that Workforce Solutions Capital Area is our local connection to local workers and local opportunities. And from where I stand, 
Well, that's good for Austin, and it's good for Texas.